What's up, everybody? My name is Vincent. Welcome to Cryptolution, where we talk about everything under the moon, the crypto universe. Today is Wednesday, July 19th. In today's video, we're going to be talking about D gods, youths, and the Bitcoin D gods. I have been asked, which one should I invest in? If you are new to this ecosystem and you're not sure which NFT you want out of this entire collection within the three, then this video should help on which one may be the best fit for you. I'm going to share with you my opinion behind each one of these NFT collections behind Bitcoin D-Gods, Utes, and D-Gods, and how each one should align with you in different manners. Now, with that said, you have to support this channel. So support the algorithm, make this channel be seen by liking the button, subscribing to the channel, and don't forget to join our Patreon page. And most importantly, please be careful with any of the scammers down in the comments below. I will never reach out via WhatsApp, Telegram, direct messaging, or email, so please be careful and invest safely. So guys and girls, let's get right into it. So right now we are on the website of dlabs.xyz. Now on this page, this is basically their new roadmap. Instead of a picture being a roadmap, this is their actual website. Now I wanna pay attention to one thing and that's on the left-hand side. That's called progress, the progress bar. So right now, as you can see here, DGOD season three is the first thing that should be lined up. And after that, it's going to be Utes two, season two. Now, why am I sharing this with you? Is because we wanna understand what's gonna come first in terms of announcements. Now, before we even talk about this collections, let's talk about Bitcoin DGODs. Is this collection right for you? So Bitcoin DGODs right now, we don't know if there's any utility. Right now, all that we know around Bitcoin D gods is that really, it's just art. It's just a store of value. It's just basically, uh, that's its intrinsic purpose. So if you buy one of these NFTs, do not expect right now an art upgrade. Do not expect any utility to be announced anytime soon. Frank, the founder from D Gods, has expressed that right now the more focused on D Gods and Utes. So right now, people that invest in this type of project are investing in possibly the chance of this floor price going to 1.13 to 3.33 Bitcoin. So that's a lot of money considering that Bitcoin's around 29 to 30 thousand dollars at the time of this recording. But nonetheless, we've seen 158. Bitcoin total trading volume, which is still a lot of money. So this is right now the second most traded collection on the Bitcoin Ordinals blockchain. Now, when you buy into these NFTs, you are going to be part of a specific group of people. But again, not many people have 30 to 29,000 US dollars. So if that's too much money for you and you don't feel like spending that amount for something that isn't going to be delivered anytime soon, well, don't worry. This collection next is probably the best bet, and that's going to be Utes. Now, Utes is a collection that came out after D Gods. Now, this is a much more affordable price. Right now, 1.7 Ethereum is the floor price. They do have a good amount of trading volume in terms of Ethereum. So it's 7,272 Ethereum, but know this, this is on the Polygon blockchain. And because this is not on the Ethereum blockchain, it's a lot harder for people to understand how to transfer funds, how to buy these things on a totally different blockchain, especially if they're not buying with Matic tokens, they're buying with Ethereum tokens. But right now, if you look at the lowest cost in US dollar conversion, right now it's around 3,324. That's a lot cheaper than paying 29,000 or 30,000 for a Bitcoin D gods. Now, why is this collection something that you should focus on? Well, I definitely think that because this is just season one, which is the artwork that you're seeing right here, I do believe season two is gonna have elevated art upgrades or art realizations, quote unquote, what, how Frank describes it. So knowing how D gods went from that to dead gods from the art upgrade, I can only expect that this is only gonna get a lot better. Plus there's a lot of great traits on the floor as of right now. But also keep in mind, when we go back to the D-Labs page, we do know that down below, we do see this. Time to finish what we started. It has the Utes name and also the number 535 and the orange color. So this is a hint from what people are speculating is that there's going to be a migration of Utes over to the Bitcoin Ordinals blockchain. But there's only gonna be 535. And keep in mind, there is a large collection of Utes out there on Polygon. So keep in mind, this collection is roughly around 15,000 of these NFTs, but only 13,000 are listed on the floor, meaning not many people have actually minted out the mint tubes. And I do believe that there are major gains ahead for this collection once announcements do come up. And I do expect that this price could be fluctuating between 1.7 to even 1.5 Ethereum, just because we aren't expecting any new announcements anytime soon. As you've seen on this chart, that when we scroll up to the progress bar, we do still have a lot of time left. 
So let's go ahead and talk about the last collection that has more upside, but also more intrinsic value, and that's going to be D-Gods. This is the best NFT collection out there. And right now the D-Gods have turned into dead gods. And these dead gods are gonna turn into something else for season three which is supposed to be announced within July. And right now, we don't have much time in July left, so that's what we're hearing is that this delay is gonna to come to an end very, very soon, and that we're gonna see all these different upgrades for these D-Gods or Dead Gods turn into something else. Right now, the floor price is pretty high. It's around nine Ethereum. But again, if you compare this to, say, Board Ape Yacht Club, Board Ape Yacht Club used to be around 100 ETH floor price, and now it's hovering around almost close to 30 Ethereum. Right now, D-Gods is at 9 Ethereum, and this is aiming to be the number one collection right now on Ethereum. And not too long ago, I did a poll between should I represent my UNFT or my D-God NFT as my PFP profile picture on my Twitter, and somebody asked me and said, you know what, would you prefer to rock a Board Ape Yacht Club or a Mutant Ape Yacht Club? And Mutant Ape Yacht Club is actually the second collection that came out of Board Apes. And obviously the greatest answer out of that is obviously I would be rocking a board ape. So obviously the answer here is that I would be rocking a D God instead of a Ute. But again, it's a lot more price here. But this collection has a little bit more representation, a lot more recognition, a lot more support from the community, but nonetheless, these collections are doing great. So again, we're gonna talk about D-Gods as the number one collection if I were to get into something like this, but again, you have to have nine Ethereum at the lowest cost, which is roughly around $17,000. But if you don't have that amount of money and you just wanna have exposure to this community, then I would just go for Utes. Utes is the best way to have exposure at a dirt cheap price. And honestly, the artwork is still phenomenal. I love that these characters, there's nothing like that out there in the Ethereum ecosystem. And I definitely think that there's a lot of uh, support, but also a lot of effort from the team to create these individual characters. But if you don't want to go for this, and if you have a lot of money, then maybe have one of these Bitcoin D gods in your portfolio in case you want to have that exposure. Because again, I do think that this floor price can reach 3.33 Bitcoin in the near future. So with that said, let me know your thoughts down below between the three different collections. Which one do you want to have exposure? Do you want to have exposure into Bitcoin D gods? Utes or D gods for season three. And I want to hear your thoughts because right now this video is supposed to be educational and formative for you to know which investment decision is best to get exposure to this collection. Keep in mind, none of this is financial advice. This is just my opinion. So keep this as just entertainment value. I don't want you to invest in something just because I said so. You have to do your own due diligence because everybody's financial situations are different from one another. So keep that in mind before you end up investing in any of these NFTs. So with that said, if you like what you heard and like what you've seen, you have to smash up the like button. Also subscribe to the channel and don't forget to join our Patreon page to receive all of our alpha calls and buy and sell orders, both NFTs, cryptocurrencies, and everything within the DGOD use and Bitcoin DGOD's NFT ecosystem. With that said, I'll see you guys and girls next time.